dangerous, yes. But it is restoring something vital to my people. Give me the Arul in home. What if I don't do it? Ah, I feel like if I don't stop her, I'll regret it. And if I don't give it to her, I will lose her forever. Like, our friendship is gone. I, I can't do it. Hello sandwich friends, welcome back to the Yucky Ham Sandwich channel, I'm Yucky. So I deliberately did all of the side quests, and most of them is just fetch quests. So I didn't want you guys to just watch me running around doing about the same thing. I just did the Lost Patrol uh, for the Canary side quest, so I'm reporting in. I found your patrol. They won't be coming back. Nope, they're not. You have stolen my duty, Basra. We were supplied for this task. But you have done this instead. Take what was meant for us. Uh, look at his head, his head is hanged down. But it was a quest! Are we not supposed to do anything about it? I don't know. So now the plan is to do all my companions' quests so we don't miss those. I'm pretty sure there is a high interest of seeing those. And then we'll go into the main quest with the Canaries. So right now we are giving back that ship to Isabella that we found. So we come down where we're not ready. You take a grave risk in trusting Hello? Talk to her. Welcome to the Anged Man. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh, sure, any news? What's the word on the street? Liam, the Arbor Master, was in the raider's pockets. And he seemed like such an honest man. Grumpy, but honest. What else? Any other news? There's been a bunch of elves camped out on Sundermount for ages. People say they're starting a settlement. Can they do that? The land doesn't belong to them. Huh. I Thanks. doubt. I doubt I it. Go. The elves Anytime. don't really... Uh, the Danish elf don't really settle down, ever. I have something for you. You thought I do. Ooh, what's this? Oh, isn't that just the cutest thing? The best thing is below decks. <laughs> cute? Baby animals are cute. Ships? Not so much. Thank you, Hawk. This was a thoughtful gesture. I've been thinking about what happened with Hadriana. Right, you killed her. I took out my anger on you, undeservedly so. I was not myself. I'm sorry. I understand. You There's were a slave. No to you try to hunt down you your master. You were generous. When I was still a slave, Hadriana was a torment. She would ridicule me, deny my meals, oh. hound my sleep. Because of her status, I was powerless to respond. And she knew it. The thought of her slipping out of my grasp now. I couldn't let her go. I wanted to, but I couldn't. Especially if you're gonna give someone your word, saying that, hey, I'm not gonna kill you if you tell me where my sister is, then I'll let you live. But instead, he killed her. Anyways, let's just, you want it to? What do you mean? This hate. I thought I'd gotten away from it. But it dogs me no matter where I go. To feel it again. To know it was they who planted it inside me. It was too much to bear. Mm. Ah, but I didn't come here to burden you further. He has too much hatred, I guess. He did what he did, and it's done. So is he gonna go try to find his family now? His, like his sister? Because he, he did get information about it. Are you going to use the information Hadriani gave you? Yeah. I don't know yet. I will have to think on it. Okay. There's an elven woman here, sir. What? She claims she was sent here by you. I, uh, I didn't know where to tell her. What do you mean, Bodan? Quite a lovely estate you have here. How about Sandal? Your right? house is... I'm sorry I broke it. Uh, what? Yes. Broke well, what? We'll get that replaced right away. Sorry. But broke what? That big tower in the lake is scary. The big tower in the lake is scary. Why? Uh, how about mother? Does mother know? I've been wondering if I shouldn't remarry. I'm sure the last thing you need is your mother watching over your shoulder every time you come home. But perhaps there is still life once your children have outgrown you. Yeah, I just want you to be happy. You've been through a lot. You deserve any joy you she can find. She deserves happiness. Thank you, love. No one could ever replace your father. 
But it is refreshing to think I could still be courted at this age. I look at her. She's so pretty. Her mother is gorgeous at her age. How are you doing? Greetings, mistress. Your home was difficult to find. I've never been out on my own before, but I found it. Many people know of you. I hope I've made myself useful. I've already begun cleaning, and I can cook. Not as good as Papa, but a little. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Well, I'm going to pay you. If you're staying here, Orana, it will be as my servant. You mean I won't be a slave? No,、anymore? I don't want you、You'll、to be, be a slave like anyone else. Yeah, I. A slave is all I've ever been, like Papa and Grandpapa before me. Well, it's going to be different with me. I'll try to be、me. a good servant. Thank you, Mistress. You're too good to me. Oh, that's so heartfelt. I don't know how I feel about that. That made me happy. You got my letter. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this, and I did. Right. Now, after a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. Right. One of our miners, Sabine, has been leaking information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown in Ferelden. What's the I name? I would like you to get this festering sore to divulge who is behind the theft. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. Is he from Lodring? Who is this man? Yeah. I would not expect you to recall every piss pot from your past. I don't remember Sabine. He must be from the outlying farms. Well, he brags to his fellows that he grew up with you in Lodring. Oh, of course. Let's get ready and let's go. Bring Sabine back to my place. Excellent idea. I will get him now. Here is the dung pile I caught leaking next week's shipment schedule. He won't tell me who he's working with. Oh, who maybe you tell me. me Whoa! No, tell need me no need the violence. No need the violence. Instead of beating the poor man, let's appeal to his better nature. Please, Miss. Maybe、Sarah、some coins. I knew you since you was young and lothering. I knew your mum's family and your pop. Mike, you got him rest. Pathetic. Oh my God, dude! I Calm down. I leave this bastard in your capable hands. Get me when he's ready to talk. No need to spit on、Don't、someone like、Sarah. that. Us Lothering folk should stick together. So why did you do it? What made you betray your employer? Yeah. Before the blight, my family had a good life in Lothering. Clean home, fertile land, friends. And we lost all that. Good boy, lived in a hovel. People spit on us. Oh. And sometimes we went hungry. I understand. I know it was hard to leave Lothring. Talk to me, so we can put all this behind us. As soon as I tell Hubert what he wants to know, he'll kill me or throw me in prison. My life's not worth much, but my family. I only wanted to give my wife and son a better life. Well, I'll help you. I'll deal with Hubert. Just give us something to go on. Yep. Oh, thank you, Monsieur. I'll talk. See, no need to violence. This is Lily of the Cotery. Given the importance of stopping the cargo robberies, I have enlisted a consultant. A consultant. consultant. Sure, whatever helps you sleep at night. <laughs> well, Doug, are you ready、yeah. to bark now? There's an ambush planned tonight at Dietrich Crossing. Tonight? That leaves you barely enough time to intercept them. You had best leave immediately. We'll protect your precious shipment, but make sure you have the coterie's payment. Want me to deal with this runt? Free of charge. I'll drop him in a ditch on our way out. No. Yes, take him. With my blessing. I assume my partner will not object. We're letting Sabine go. A leave him alone. A public showing of mercy will be good for morale. Let him go. Yeah. But he's a Ferel, a criminal. Nobody will care what happens to him. Exactly. Think about it. Sabine turned to crime for two reasons. He's desperate. Yes. And he bears no love for you. Spare him publicly, and you'll earn some loyalty from the miners. See, win-win. I see your point. Very well. For the sake of morale, I will spare this dog. Ugh. Oh, Can we not you, talk、Ms. to human like this? I deserve it, but thank you. We're wasting time. If you find naught but corpses at the ambush, 
It won't be my fault. Okay. We're too late for your boys, but we'll make the rushes. Less talking, more killing, then. Let's finish this! Yeah, pound you guys. Let's kill the leader first! See, they dead, bro. My dog. Eat them, doggy! Oh. My special's still on cooldown. Ah, easy peasy. That was almost too easy. Exactly. Because you got us. Wait. <laughs> I recognize that lout. What? Who is he? He's in the coterie. One of that damned fool Brecker's men. They are attacking me? So your organization is behind this. We got explicit orders not to. Hubert's been good on his payments. If Brecker ordered this, the rest of his life will be very short and painful. And who is this person? Tell me about this man. He operates out of the south side. Always had more balls than sense. His lackeys are loyal. Brecker must be involved. Okay. Well, time to meet this person. Let's pay Brecker a social call. We've got a lot to talk about. <laughs> a I've social call. to be call. sure first. I know who to lean on to get answers. Find me in the Undercity. The Undercity. Oh, she's dead. What happened? Don't let them get away. Wait, what? You Coterie, one of Lily's friends. Lily was one of ours. She was working for you and now she's dead. You get one chance. Did you kill her? She's dead when I got here. What do Lily you mean? Lily didn't die by my hand. Someone else did this. Maybe you guys Explain killed her. Explain yourself. Well, we're on the same side. Isn't minor misunderstandings aside. I believe our purposes are the same. One of the scum that attacked my caravans worked for someone in the coterie named Brecker. Yeah. Lily said she'd look into it. I think Brecker had her killed. Brecker? Hmm. If you're lying, I'll find you. Men, I'm not lying. We have to get to the bottom of this. Now. Okay, uh, uh, is that it? Okay. I think we need to talk to... Oh, it's right here. All right, after fighting a bunch of thugs, we found them. You must be Brecker. Yep. And you're that lice-covered refugee. What? Lice-covered refugees? Stop attacking my shipment. You'd better leave the bone pit shipments alone. Understand? You're making demands of me. Yeah. You own half a stake in a mine and you think you're somebody, huh? Some Ferelden's don't have the courtesy of knowing when to bloody die. Do you know who I am? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he jumps around, huh? My dog. Wow. He's dead. Hey, your master is dead. There's no reason to attack me no more. <laughs> There we go. Dang, 600 XP? Woo! Lovely. Oh, there's a gold. I can't do that. Um. Let me up Varric and see if he can actually open some chests now. It is time, Varric, that you can open some complex chests. <laughs> it is time. Back to Herbert. Hubert. <laughs> I found the thieves responsible for the cargo thefts. I put them out of business. Excellent. With that resolved, the mine's profits will soar. Yay! For now, partner, please be sure to visit our workers occasionally. You have a knack for keeping them happy. Great! Love to hear that. What are you doing? Putting out milk. I miss having a cat around. Aww. But I think the refugees have scared them all off. Or maybe eaten them. You know, I've been meaning to thank you. For what? You don't need to stick your neck out for the mages here. 
But you have. My sister is you a let mage. let those apostates from Starkhaven start over. Maybe they can be an example for the world. We're in a love interest now. I root for the little guy. I've always had a thing for scrappy underdogs. <laughs> I've tried to hold back. You saw what I almost did to that girl. Yeah, You've that you did. I am, but I'm still a man. You can't tease me like this and expect me to resist forever. I guess, yeah, kiss me, let's go. I don't want you to resist. <laughs> oh my god, in front of the companions. <laughs> wow, okay. That's something. This will be a disaster, but I can't live without it. We could die tomorrow. I don't want it to be before I tell you how I feel. Oh, great. Well, tell me then. Ooh, is it in verse? I hope it's in verse. <laughs> I thought with justice, this part of me was over. I can't give you a normal so... life. So... If you're with me, we'll be hunted, hated. The whole world will be against us. The whole world will be against us. Now, <laughs> I will come to you. If not, I'll know you took my warning at last. So, with Anders, if he likes me, is he likes me or Justice likes me? Or both of them likes me? Very confusing. <laughs> what is that exclamation mark? Let me go over there for a second because I do need to, like, get some, um, a few things, like potions. You! This is your fault! What? You and that blighter, Varric Tethras! What did I do? Yeah, what did he do? You'll be the end of my voice. Have we met? I don't even know who you are. Yeah. Yevon, member in good standing of the Dwarven Merchants Guild. Right. Not that it really matters to people like you. Yes, it does. Like, what exactly did I do? You'll have to be more specific. A lot of things are my fault. <laughs> my sons are lost in the deep roads because of right. stories about you. Okay. You're sodding glory and treasure. There was a lot don't of treasure. Don't you dare blame her. We both know this was Iwin's doing. If you want to keep your job, shut your mouth, woman. Dang. Your boys are grown men. It was their own decision. That requires an explanation. What exactly were they trying to do? Yeah. It may be my fault, Monsieur. I've told them all the stories about you. Right. You're the only one who knows where they went. They were following the path of your expedition. <sighs> Please help me find them. Don't let my boys die down there. Okay, what happened, though? Your sons made an expedition into the Deep Roads. Did anyone go with them? They went alone, the fools. Just my three boys against every dark spawn in the Deep Roads. Jeez. I one is Yevon's middle son. The whole thing was his idea. Emrys and Merrin were just following his lead. The greedy bastard didn't want to hire anyone else if it meant he had to share the spoils. Sounds familiar. <laughs> yeah. I thought coming to the surface meant I would never have to face losing my sons to the dark spawn. Right. Well, tell me about Iwan. Sounds like you're none too fond of Iwan, dear. He's always been such a greedy thing, even as a boy. Stop talking about my son like that. He thinks he'll get rich quick off this expedition. Well, I kind of did. Emrys and poor Merrin into going. Well, tell me about what Merrin. What about the other one, Merrin? Marin's a dear, sweet lad. Raised him myself since the day his mom died. He's the one who liked the stories best. He wanted to be a hero, though, Aww. not just rich. He craved adventure. Adventures adventure out there. That boy needs to settle down and learn a trade. Play it safe. Play it safe is boring, but learning a trade is important. Trade school, it's the way to go nowadays. I forgot how to say his name, but what about this person? Tell me about Emrys. Um, Emrys. He's the oldest. Okay. But Iwan's been bossing him around since he learned to talk. Man's near <laughs> 30 and has no backbone whatsoever. Oh, man. His mother's death hit him hard, but ah. he shouldn't be looking to his brothers for guidance. Well, I'll do it. I'll do everything in my power to bring your sons home. At least I I'll try. I should approve, but it seems like I save a lot of fools from themselves. <laughs> Thank you, Masser. Those boys are my life. Of course. They entered the deep roads using the same passage you did. Please find them. I will see you rewarded for your efforts. Well, you don't have to reward me. I feel like it's kind of our fault in a way that now everybody knows Deep Rose maybe get dips on whatever is left that we didn't take. So I understand. I will go to Averlene first and then we'll go back to um, the Fool's Gold mission.
Years of nice, quiet anxiety. Oh no! Gone. This is not uh, Along Aveline's with a whole street. That's okay. The canary were blameless. Right. A mad elf pushed by zealots, likely hidden in the very groups I have to appease. The maker has a grand sense of humor. Does he now? And the Arishok. I suspected he had no plans to leave. That no. I didn't know it was just as annoying for him. And I have no idea why they won't leave. <laughs> what doesn't annoy you him? You could send him gold and he'd <laughs> complain it was heavy. <laughs> and it's about to get worse. A shame. There were overtures of civility. Uh, your influence, no doubt. What happened? Yeah. Now what? A Canari delegate and entourage paid me a visit. It was civil, tentative, hopeful. That's good. They left my chambers with precision. But were not reported by the outer guard. They are missing almost literally from my doorstep. What do you imagine will be the Arishok's reaction? Uh, well, I will find out what happened. We need to get out in front of this and fast. I feel I've been trying to turn a stampede for some time now. Someone is pushing very hard. Mm. Speak with Seneschal Brown. Then you will see why I cannot trust anyone else with this. Okay. I don't know who would benefit from fighting the Konari, but it will cost all of us. Yes, there's... Uh, I really don't want to fight the Konaris. You're looking well. But it seems like the Konaris are... Um, what's that word that I'm looking for? They're converting people to the Kuhn, like the elves and humans, all of the likes. I guess people are getting antsy. I don't it's know. different here as captain. Feels like family. Okay, let's talk to Evelyn now. Hawk, I need a favor that I can only trust to you. Sure. You can always ask. Yeah, we're best it should friends. Be a small matter, but I worry. I need you to give something to Guardsman Donick here in the barracks. No questions, and he is not to know it's from me. This is the guard we rescued, Donick. The one we pulled from an ambush. Why are we doing the that? The event that put me here. But this is a different need of the guard and its captain. And you're doing very badly at the no questions part. Uh, mm, should I ask or else she's gonna get mad? Fine. Um, I wish I can romance Aveline, but I can't romance Aveline and Anders. I'm not like that. All right. Very well, Aveline. If it means that much. Thank you. And please hurry back with his reaction. I appreciate this, Hawk. I really do. All right. Maybe she liked the dude? I don't know. Guardsman Donick. Sir R. Hawk, it's been some time. You're here in Hightown now, right? I think the captain mentioned it. I see your uncle now and then on my patrols, but we don't talk. Have you fully recovered? No ill effects from the ambush, I trust. They got me pretty good, I'll admit. But they fared worse, so I can't complain. Guard is a good career if you're careful. A short one if you're not. Mm, yes, and the captain same makes thing sure with the military. <laughs> Can that be amusing? A secret gift? I have it on good authority that you are going to enjoy this. Am I now? It's a copper relief of... Marigolds? Let me look at his uh, face. And it helpfully says so. Marigolds. Well, how crafty. Is there a meaning to this that I should know? He seemed very happy. I don't know, there must be. Just keep it. I'm sure it's more than it seems. It would have to be. Right. I'm sure we both have things to do. Of varying import. Sarah Hawk. At that the was end. Awkward. What was Aveline thinking? Yeah, that was very awkward. At the end, he had this eye thing. What was that? Does you're back. Of course you are. You're efficient. Get things done, good or ill. So, how did Donick react? Well, as one might expect when confused. Yeah. I thought it happy was happy then confused. Metal is strong, copper age as well, flowers are soft. I've clearly gone about this the wrong way. Don't talk to him again. <laughs> just take this, the patrols for next week. Post it to the roster and just Listen. Do this yourself? Really? Just walk over there and post the roster. I want his honest reaction without the captain present. You could just have him hauled off. 
This isn't about an accusation I can put in a report and explain. I need someone unofficial. Ah, uh, fine, I'll do it. Hosting the roster just over there. I need to know exactly how he reacts. That's key. I uh, I you. want to know what's going on. Can you give me something? She'd like... do a lot better to just get this fellow alone in a room. Life's too short. Uh, why are we doing this? A duty roster. There. Hey, Donick. Whose pucker have you been greasing to get high town? What? You're daft. I'm working dockside on those smugglers. Says here you're guarding the square. Always been a make-work job, that one. You someone's pet? Check mm. your eyes. It's a mistake. Says the pet. You have got to be kidding me. Huh. What did I do to get that post? Interesting. I don't know why anyone would embarrass me with a patrol like this. Guarding the market. Is that all the captain thinks I'm worth? Okay. Good things are always happening to that bastard. Right funny it is, how favors spring up around here. Okay. All right, Aveline. Donick thinks I'm punishing him. But Hightown is a safe patrol, a reward. You wanted his reaction. All right. I can fix this. I need... I need three goats and a sheaf of wheat. You'll take them to his mother. What? What is happening? It's a dowry tradition. Maybe it will smooth the process. I think my jaw just landed in the deep road somewhere. <laughs> Not a word, dwarf. Uh. I wouldn't dream of mocking your unconventional courtship. Oh my god, is that how she show her love? Why not just tell me? Evelyn, you know you can talk to me. Yeah. What am I to say? That a grown woman can't speak her mind. I've been focused on being captain for so long. That's all I know. Oh. It can't be a complete mystery. You were married once, right? Yeah. And that was a long time ago. It was easier. Or seemed to be. Oh, that's so sweet, guys. Why is this so difficult for you? I can't imagine you having trouble speaking your mind. The guards are in my care. I hurt when they hurt. Oh. But Donick, I want him to know that I feel. But if something happened to him. Something already happened, and he's fine. Yeah. If it made sense, I wouldn't need you. I feel paralyzed. I hate it. Oh, so. I don't want to ask that. So you're over West. You never get over somebody. I'm pretty sure it's still in her memories. Sounds like you're ready to move on. It's been four years yeah. since Wesley. Stop trying to protect me. I've made my peace. You'd want me to live. Yes, that he would. You've been alone this long. So you've been by yourself since we came to Kirkwall? I am diligent on behalf of my men. And I've neglected many other things. Mm. If you need this, I'll help. Well, this little dance certainly isn't helping. So what will? I'm the captain. He's my guardsman. I can't get past that. There are places in the city where no one cares that you're a captain. What? Just go out somewhere? Like it's that easy? Uh, yes, it can be. What? Too simple? Tell Donick. Invite him to the hanged man. Don't tell him about me. Make something up. It's a surprise, or just you, or a group, anything to get him there. He's not like the others. I don't want him to think he's meeting the captain. Aww. Okay, I'm excited. I I can't wait to see how this plans out. All right. Clear all right, off no. now, all right? Where are you? Sir Ardonic, are you free? I need to ask you something. I have no immediate patrols. Why? Everyone's going Imagine out! The hanged man for all the guard. You'll come? Of course you'll come. Should I have heard of this? Very well, Sir Ahawk. I guess I'll be there. Yeah, let's go. I'm so happy for Averline. I need to talk to Varric too. Alright, Gossman. There were supposed to be others coming, right? It's heavily gonna Plans dress up change, too? Apparently. Right. Look, <laughs> I should really, um... Just 
Give it a moment. Please. Not suspicious at all? Evely, uh, where are round. you? Make her yes. Oh, she's nervous. Come on, Aveline. <laughs> I look crazy. <laughs> Come on, Aveline. Don't step me out like that. Aveline is great. Look, if this was all an attempt to get closer to me through the captain, um... You're just not my type. Ouch! All this playing shy business. I like a little backbone. I have to go. Thanks for the drinks. Dang it. Evelyn! I... I couldn't do it. What did he say? You need some backbone. I'm interested in him. You know that's not true. If you were that far gone, you'd have hidden from the start. Would it have ended any worse? I need to talk to him. But I'm a mess unless I'm on patrol. I'm good at that. Then do it when Killing he's on patrol. Killing doesn't exactly provide an intimate setting, though. And I'm tired of embarrassing myself. No excuses. Arrange a patrol. Then I'll clear the way and you'll talk to Donick. Yeah! Putting you in danger just makes it worse. You made it my problem. I'm fixing it. Very well, Hawk. You pushed. You clear the route up the wounded coast and I... Will live to regret this, I'm sure. Hey, goodness. Laura, you and me in my room. I don't know whether to cherish every moment I am with Viru you. Viru 5? Why? I just there. helped her. I don't Thank understand. And then Hawk tore the door clean off its hinges, walked into the room, and... <clears throat> I guess we'll finish this later. Of course, telling stories about me. Bag. For you, I have all the time in the world. <laughs> Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. Great. You and, uh, what's his name? That mage. Seem to be getting pretty close. Blondie? So, what's <laughs> going on, Hawk? You jealous? Well, well, well. I never thought you were the type, Varric. I'm flattered. <laughs> it's the chest hair, isn't it? Women can never resist my chest hair. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's not to be. I'm spoken for. Uh, Bianca stands in my way again, does she? What can I say? She's the jealous type. I bet. Listen, as your friend, I feel like I'd be doing you a disservice if I didn't say something. Okay. Maybe, just maybe, getting involved with the possessed mage might be dangerous. Dangerous there, is my I name! My <laughs> well, that does sounds perfect for me. In all the time you've known me, have I ever given you the impression that I was turned off by crazy? <laughs> <laughs> we need some crazy okay, in our lives. point taken. <laughs> Thank you, though, Varric. A good friend will always tell you the truth, no matter what. Not sugarcoat anything. So this route's pretty quiet? Please, Abby. Yes, and it's a real nice night for an evening. Um, <laughs> as you say, Captain. <laughs> yes, as I say. Gaffeline, come on. Maker, she's bad at this. She's terrible at this. Ugh. All right, Aveline, you can do this. If it isn't done right, the blade can be too soft. Quenching the steel is a vital step that can make or break a sword. Right. Right. A blade for every purpose. What do you think about blades? <sighs> I'm really, sorry, Captain. Come on. I drifted off a bit. Right, of course. <gasps> Pain. God! Well, Guardsman, good patrol. I think we're done. And Come on, Aveline! I... Hawk, what a surprise. What are you doing here? <sighs> Aveline. Come on. Hawk, don't. Uh, I don't want to intervene. This is her thing. I don't know this is the right thing to do. Uh, this is not... this is not... Uh... We don't have all night, you know. Would someone please tell me what's going on? All right, 
I'm going to draw a picture of where she wants to touch you. <laughs> oh my Captain. God. Uh, I should get uh, back to the barracks. Uh, Varric. Damn it. I thought we were friends. We are friends. Friends sometimes push. I I have to fix this. You'll file a complaint. Ask for a transfer. <sighs> you. You're coming to the barracks to explain why you put him on the spot. Double time, Hawk. Or so help me. God damn it. We did terrible, guys. Uh, we shouldn't have pushed it. I have no choice. And I don't want to, like, say that I like her because I don't. Because I'm not going to play doubles like that. Like, if I say I would like one person, I would like one person. Wow, what am I going to do? I messed it up. I messed up her love. God dang. Maker. Where is Donic? I have to head this off before it goes to the Viscount. Calm Maybe down, a formal apology. Something that shows the guards they can still trust me. Uh, they will understand. You're their captain, not a goddess. They expect you to have feelings. Yes. Not if they get in the way of the job. You don't know that. I won't be that stupid again. <clears throat> My apologies, Sir Ahawk, but I need a moment with the captain. Guardsman Donick. Please. Yeah. Maybe he will open up his feelings. So... Oh my god. This is killing me. <laughs> She's giggling. Good sign. So that's good? Aveline. So? Guardsman Donick did not file a complaint. That's good. This was all incredibly stupid. And you made it wonderful. You help with both? I think you can safely claim both halves of that pair. You're sweet. I knew asking you was the right thing. Oh, God, I thought our friendship was, like, it. gone. I just... There's no way I can ever repay you. No, you don't have to repay Perhaps me. It's simple. I just want Thank your friendship. You. No, a loading screen. <sighs> no. <laughs> God dang it, guys. One thing about this game is that you have to constantly save because this happens a lot. Dang, this is like an, an important moment. I thought our friendship was broken and gone forever. I was freaking out over here. Anyways, I guess I'll go back a little bit and uh, come back to this part. There's no way. And I now we're back. You. Perhaps it's simple. Thank you. Hey, can I ask you something? Oh no. Was there a moment when you thought I was beyond help? Never. Not for a second. You don't lie very well. As far as you know. Shout when you need me, Hawk. I'll always be here for you. Oh, I'm glad that our Just friendship is okay. knock first. Oh good. I was about to say, can we have friendship plus 10? Because last time was like negative five. Like, <gasps> oh no, our friendship. Okay, good. We're still friends. <laughs> That's all I was worried about. She's my best friend. What the heck? Okay, now I'm gonna go do other companion quests. I've got something to show you. Come and see. Ooh. I'm very spiky. <gasps> it's beautiful, isn't it? Yes, it is. Of all the giant mirrors in your house, Meryl, this is easily the nicest. I knew if anyone would understand, you would. What is I've it? I've spent the last few years restoring this. One of my clan found it in the Brazilian forest, we think. Ah, uh, okay. Poor Tamlin. We never found him. Just the shattered pieces of the Alluvion. The Alluvion, okay. Why did you bring it here? What are you trying to do with this mirror? At first, I just wanted to find Tamlin. But it's been too long. Tamlin is probably dead by now, if he wasn't already. But still, I know it can help my people. I can at least recover this one small part of our heritage. Oh, I guess we're gonna do like a, some sort of rescue mission. 
Is this why you left the clan? This thing is what made the Keeper send you away, isn't it? The Keeper wanted me to destroy the fragment I kept. She said our ancestors meant it to be forgotten. Huh? But it's a Keeper's place to remember. Yeah! Even the I was dangerous confused. things. We argued. I... left. I She's see. She's wrong. This mirror could teach us so much about who we once were. Okay, the mirror killed someone? Do you think the mirror had something to do with Tamlin's disappearance? The ruin we trapped Tamlin to was full of traps and monstrous things. But we found no body. His trail ended at the broken pieces of Alluvion. Well, I'm glad you told me. I'm sure you wouldn't show something this dangerous to just anyone. It's not dangerous, I promise. I fixed it, or all tried to. With blood magic. The mirror won't hurt anyone. With blood I magic, every though. every time she says that. She has no idea what she's messing with. Yeah. I do. I have it totally under control. But it doesn't work. I've tried everything, and I think it's because it needs to be finished with a special tool. And a rule in home. And my clan has one. It's been in their hands for generations. There's always a catch. I hear a but coming. I can't go back there alone. You have no idea, the Keeper. I... I can't talk to her. We fight or, or talk circles around each other. She has a disappointed frown that turns your bones to jelly. Please help me. You will, won't you? Sure, I guess. I'll go with you. Maseranus, I'll find some way to repay you, I promise. Well, let's talk to the leader now. I mean, keep her. You return to us, darling. Have you reconsidered this path at last? You can do this, Meryl. Go on. I'm with you. Thank you, Hawk. Keeper, I need the Arulin home, the ancient carving blade that Master Island keeps. I see. You wish to rebuild the Alluvian. Yes, you don't that have to she is. Of it. I'm invoking Via Sulavanan. I'll do whatever task you wish. Well, I'm glad to know I can still disapprove. It is your right. I will give you a service to perform if you insist. Wait, what is this? What exactly is this thing we're asking for? It is an ancient carving tool. Used by our wood shapers, passed down for countless generations. Right. Our clan has carried it since before the fall of the Dales. It is as old as Arlathan itself. Uh, Arlathan is old, so what's going on? What did Meryl invoke? Our history belongs to all Dalish child. So our clan's most cherished relics can be claimed by everyone. Any Dalish can perform a service for the clan and gain ownership of such an item. Oh. For a time. That is what Meryl has invoked. Even if she has chosen to live apart, she is still one of the people. Thank you, Keeper. We appreciate your help. This means a lot to Meryl. I'm glad that Meryl has a friend in you, child. I hope you will look after her. Well, I've been doing I can that. I take care of myself, Keeper. Yes, Dalen. I know. Avar Terrell has taken the lives of three of our hunters. It lairs in a cavern in the mountainside. Seek it out. Slay it. No one else must fall to its anger. Okay. Do this for us. And I will give you the Arulin home. May the Dread Wolf never catch your scent. All right. I guess we made it. Is someone there? It's safe. You can't come out. We we don't bite. Hello. Hi. Praise and trust. I mean the creators. I thought I'd never get out of Meryl. Anethera, Paul. Are you hurt? Stay back. What do you want from me? Whoa, Paul. What's, what's wrong? wrong? I'm here to help. Stay back! Don't touch me! What? Uh... It's only Meryl! Meryl couldn't hurt you if she tried. At worst, she might make frowny faces. <laughs> what? She'll do worse than hurt me. Don't you know what she is? What do you Creators, mean? Please help me! Someone, please! Paul, no! We have to catch him, hurry! What do you mean by... that? What... Who is Meryl? I know she used blood magic, but... 
Oh my god, what is that? Well, he's gonna die. Hold on, Paul. We're coming. What the heck is this? You can't even kill this thing, like, so tall. All we can do is, like, slice the legs. Go down. Am I hurting it? Okay, we are. Damn spiders. Ah. Oh, no. There's so many of them. What the heck? No, yes you are. Don't you die on me, Barry. Okay, cool. Uh, where? Okay. Whoa! Hey! My dog. Ow. Let me get some, um... Okay, he's almost dead. Very close. Uh, come on, come on, come on. So close, so close. So close, die. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We almost had it. We almost had it. Just one shot, one shot. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Paul? Maybe it's not too late. You, you can mean? help him, can't you, Anders? You can heal anyone. Meryl... He's gone. <laughs> I have no idea what is happening here. Why did you run? You shouldn't have run! <laughs> Why... Did he run? What did you do to scare this man to death? I'll give you a hint. It has to do with demons and slitting your wrists. What? Want some time? Do you need a minute alone? No. Thank you. I... We have too much to do for me to sit here bawling. Paul wasn't like the others. He was city-born. Worldly. He ran away from the Denerum and found us. Ah. I thought if anyone would understand, he would. This... Something is very wrong. I want to see the Keeper. The Varterol is dead. Yeah, the Varterol is dead. Maseranus. I'll breathe easier Creepy knowing thing. that we will lose no more people to it. We lost Paul. In the cave, he... He fled at the sight of me. Straight into the Vaterol. I want to know why. Many of the clan fear you will bring back the corruption. Or worse, from the mirror. Ah. And where did they get that idea? Okay. I am their keeper, Dalen. It was my duty to warn them. It's still not too late for you to return to us. Reconsider. There's no need for you to live alone. Must we go over this again? You'll never accept what I'm doing. The Eluvian is a trap. It cost us Tamlin. It led you to blood magic. Mm, I see. Will okay. you let it twist you further from who you really are? And who am I? We've done as you asked. Honor our bargain. Give me the Arulin home. Hawk, because Meryl won't listen, I give this heirloom of my clan to you for safekeeping. Please, don't let her do this. 
thank the creators. I thought maybe she'd go back on her word. Okay. She talked about blood magic. What did the Keeper mean? The mirror led you to blood magic. I... The shard I picked up was corrupted. Hmm. I couldn't cleanse it without help. The Keeper refused. She said that it belonged to another time and should be left there. So I found a... Spirit. It uh. gave me the power to purify the mirror through blood magic. Pure fight with blood magic. I've never heard of blood magic purifying anything. Right? There's it's nothing blood inherently magic. evil about blood magic. It's magic, like any other. Mm. Are you really that stupid? No. The power that contaminated the mirror was too strong to be driven out by normal means. If I had piles of lyrium lying about, I could have used that, but I didn't. I used what I had. Okay. Do you really want Is this? it worth restoring this mirror yeah. if it turns your clan against you? You know what it's like to lose everything, Hawk. Not just our land and freedom, but history, stories, language, magic, rituals. Even our gods are gone. It is mm. a sacrifice. But if the mirror restores even one fragment of the past, it's worth it. Is it though to bring back some of the past? Some past is just better left behind though. I I don't know. I think the keeper's right. Meryl, the Alluvian is ruining your life. You don't want to do this. You're siding with the keeper. Over the blood mage? I vote yes. This is dangerous, yes. But it is restoring something vital to my people. I know what I'm doing, Hawk. Give me the Arul in home. I really wish that I could like contact all of you in this fight I mean in this digital world like right in this moment sometimes it's great to live stream these things so I can ask opinion but if I do that then it won't be authentic I uh, I feel like if I don't stop her I'll regret it and if I don't give it to her I will lose her forever like our friendship is gone. But it's blood magic. I, I can't do it. I'm keeping it. I can't let you do this. You're keeping a priceless heirloom of my clan. You have no right. I don't have any You're right. You're even Dalish. I can't believe you. Why did I trust you? You're just a Shemlin like all the others. I, I have nothing further to say. Wow, 45. And Arana to Shanhok. I don't know if that was the right thing to do, but I really don't want to give it to her. I don't know what this mirror is going to bring back from the past because the past is dangerous and I don't want to be the one that bring back something awful into this world and I could have stopped it. Okay, now I'm gonna go do the Fool's Gold. I know Meryl will probably try to steal it from me. That's for sure. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'll be fighting my way through this deep road. I'm surprised she's still in my party. And she didn't just leave my party. She's still here. Why a mirror? I don't understand yes. the question. If your people were going to make a magical whatever for talking to each other, why choose a mirror? Do elves spend a lot of time talking to their own reflections? Mm. I suppose the ancient elves would have felt silly talking to them. All right. What Are happened you to one you? Of the Mistress Hawk? Please help me. Okay. My brother, Marin. I one locked him in with the dark spawn. He Why? sealed the door. Left me here and bolted for that passage. He's gone mad. Oh, All he cares no. about is that damned sword. What sword? Last time I was here, we picked this place clean. What's your brother looking for? I one called it the Heart Drinker. He says it's the masterwork of an ancient smith from this taig. Mm. He bought a book 
from one of the Orzammar caravans. It had the location of the sword. I see. Or at least to the golems who guard it. Oh, man. Is Aaron truly mad? Is your brother insane or just cruel? He wouldn't it's tell like the us relic. about the sword, but I never imagined he'd leave us to rot. This is getting just a little too familiar, isn't it? Yes. Please. I don't want my brother to be eaten by those monsters. Okay, I was safe. I'll um, do my best. Go back to your father and I'll find you when I'm done. Yeah, He's please go home. He's on the other side of that wall. You need to find a way to reach him. Please, come tell my father as soon as you have news. Well, at least he have one son. If anything. Now I'm wondering what will happen to Meryl's quest now. Like, I'm pretty sure there will be more stories after this. Can I go? No. Oh, jeez. Oh, he's fighting right now. I thought I was done for. Those sodding darkspawn jumped me out of nowhere. Nearly took my arm off. Right. My, my apologies. You saved my life, and I don't even introduce myself. I'm Iwan. Uh, good to see you. You're still alive. After what Emery's told me, I wasn't sure I'd find you in time. Emery's is still alive? Good. Why do you good. not that, want him good. to be alive? I am grateful for your timely arrival, but I'm sure Emery's mm. needs your help more. Fool still believes Marin can be saved. I'll only be a little longer, I'm sure. Then I can catch up and help you retrieve Marin's body. Where's the sword? Emery said you were after a weapon. I'm here to make sure it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. It's a dwarven artifact. It should be in dwarven hands. I have Varric. How incredibly noble of you. The ancestors would be <laughs> proud. There has to be other treasure here you can hawk. Leave me to mine. You could have died down I here. I can't just leave you alone. The Darkspawn will be back in larger numbers. No, I... I've come so far. There are more. So many more than I thought. Right. You know what? Fine. The weapon is yours if you can get to it. This isn't worth my life. What? Coward. What's the chain of heart? The man who told me about the sword sold me a control rod for a golem that protects it. You want the sword, you need the rod. What do you say? Everything I paid plus 10% for pain and suffering? Uh, Varric, you negotiate. Varric will settle on a price with you. Yep. All right, all right, it, it's yours. <laughs> Use the rod on the first golem, it should get you past the others. Okay. Oh, jeez. Do we fight it? Oh, God. Oh, that won't help us. Get my dog. Oh, jeez. One at a time. Here, come here. That's enough. I'm gonna get this guy so he moves. Let me, uh, drink some of these potions. That's enough. I'm like just hitting the rocks, really. Oh, jeez. I'm almost dead. Can I drink more potions? They're so strong. Oh. Jesus! Oh my god, they're so hard to kill! I don't know if my dog would do anything because it's just rocks! 
Oh, finally. Yeah. Die! Ooh. Definitely safe. All right. Here we go again. Whoa. Who just threw me? is so helpful. Awesome, he's dead. Nice. Cool. Let me, uh, ground poker. There you go. Is it this way? No, 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 no. Um, this other way. Pile of bones. Ah, it's here. Treasure? Oh, too late. The dark spawn smashed the chest. Oh, jeez. There's still something to salvage in this mess. Whoa, there's still a lot of stuff, though. Oh, excuse me. Was I in your way? Yes. <laughs> Right, we finally made it back from the deep roads after killing a bunch of golems and dark spawned. Let's talk to him now. Oh, Mary. Uh, hello? You. Did Iwan speak the truth? Were you too late? He's hiding something. Tell us the truth. What happened to my poor Marin? Iwan said Marin sealed himself in with the dark spawn to save his brothers. Okay. Is that what really happened, though? Is that how you remember your youngest brother dying? I... yes. It's just how I once said. Marin saved us. Really now? But he's lying. I he doesn't Marin even care about his brother. Get more treasure for himself. What? How dare you? It's true. Shut your mouth, Emrys. No. I'm through listening to you, I want. Yeah, you stand up Marin to him. With the dark yeah, that's spawn right. So you could go after that blighted weapon. Yep. No, you bastard! Iwan, is this your own brother? Get out of my sight. I'll kill you myself if I see you again. He didn't even call, father, care I... about his brother. Not one bit. You cost me my family, Hawk. This isn't over. Shouldn't have done that to your own family. <laughs> All right. I think I need to speak with Meryl, so... I am wondering how that will unfold itself. I feel like either she might leave the party or she will never speak of speak to me ever again. She's really hung up on it, huh? How could you do that to me? How could you steal a priceless relic of my people? I didn't steal it. I trusted you. I know. I'm just trying to help. Your obsession with this mirror got you exiled from your people and turned you to blood magic. Yes. It's ruining your life. Let it go. Blood magic and exile were my choice. That's true. The Illuvian had nothing to do with it. You and the Keeper may not like it, but I chose this path with my eyes open. That's true. I can't believe I've been such an idiot believing you'd help me. Go! I'd rather be alone. Yeah, we are not friends anymore. I don't know. I don't know what that relationship will be later on with Merald. I feel like she's gonna steal it from me or fight me to death with it. I don't know, but our friendship is lost. We're, in, we're, we're not in speaking terms. You bad. have information about the missing Kunari? 
I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion in this matter. I would prefer that you were not involved at all. But that is neither here nor there. Okay. Does the error shark know? Has anyone reported this to the Canari? Maker, no. I'd be signing the messenger's death warrant. He'll find out soon enough, of course. And when he does, the Viscount is rightly concerned that the illusion of peace will dissolve. Okay, could this be a Canari plot? The Arashok is growing violent. He might want an excuse to end this peace. Hmm. I suspect that if the Arashok wanted to take over, he simply would. Uh, For all we fear true, that heretical cune of his, its demands have done more to keep him in check than any of our efforts. Besides, would Kunari stoop to trickery? There is no precedent, but there is unfortunate evidence of influence on our side. You seem reluctant to look. It sounds like you don't want them found. I must think of what is best for the Viscount's office. Bringing attention to such an incident benefits no one. You would do nothing. The Kunari are neutral hostiles at best. There is no relationship to salvage by overextending ourselves on their behalf. Okay, so what is known? I'm sure you have suspicions about what happened. My concerns are well founded. This could not have escaped the notice of the city guard. Unless they were involved. Mm. Have any failed to report? Several. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. A hanged man. Hmm. Hanged man. Got to be. <laughs> Got to be. Right. Then you know what to look for. I can't imagine this has occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. A lot of coin for this place. Yeah. That's right, pal. Tonight I'm paid and blessed. And all I had to do was turn my head. Hmm. To all my friends. To all your friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heed and oxman. Evelyn. Guard captain, would you like to have a word with your man? Guard captain? Who? What? <gasps> Who? Who what? I don't... Who bought you? Who bought the honor of a proud guard of Kirkwall and made him a drunken Mabari bitch? Dang. I don't... I don't know. Really? He was a Templar, I swear. He had the seal of the Grand Cleric and everything. Oh. It's true. Okay, so we need to go to the Chantry. The penalty for abandoning your post is ten days on the wall. I expect you to report in the morning. <laughs> uh -huh. hmm. There's your answer. A Templar. Hmm. With the Grand Cleric's seal, no less. Well done. So you're taking the Captain of the Guard to accuse the Grand Cleric of funding Zealots? It's a careful chat about missing Kunari. Hmm, yes. Some days, Hawk. The Grand Cleric, please. Tell her... Tell her it concerns the Kunari. That will get her attention, for sure. Sarah Hawk. Mm. Sister Patrice. Mother Patrice. Ah. Time has changed us both. Grand Cleric Elfina cannot grant an audience to just anyone. What do you want? Canari trouble and you again. Funny how you and issues with the Canari seem to go together. Yep. And you always assume their side. I was naive when last we met. I did not want you dead. But I felt a death was necessary. That may be too fine a point for you to understand. But you must admit, you came out the better for it. Really? Well, you set me up years I ago. I know you. And I know someone is abusing the Grand Cleric's Yep. Seat. Who are you to question who serves her grace? I am sorry, but I see no reason to let you pass. How about the fact that her authority was used to abduct Kunari? She is not a happy. A cause that says you knew. But does her grace? The Grand Cleric trusts her stewards to enact the wishes of the Maker. Right. <laughs> Naughty girl. It sounds like you've been bad. 
This will shock her grace, no doubt. Stubborn. All right, Sirrah Hawk. If you won't abandon this, let me offer you something. Do I want any offer from you? The Templar you seek is a radical who has grown unreliable. Confronting him may do us all a favor. And he is what to yeah, you? Yeah, what to you? He is my former bodyguard, Ser Von El. Assume what you wish, but I offer him to you as reconciliation. Meet me at this location. I invite you, Sirrah Hawk. Come see the unrest these Kunari have inspired. Another meet me at this you location thing. Skeptical. Oh it's yeah. Her game for the moment. Yes, it is her game. Bless like any beast, remove oh, the Oh no, what the hell? Is what is this? They are weak before the faithful of the Maker. The only certainty in their precious cune is death before the righteous. What the heck? This is not right. Sevonel! Take a knee, faithful. The Chantry blesses us. You claim a blessing when you have used the authority of the Grand Cleric so openly? You have brought wrath down upon you. You remember, Sirrah Hawk? Wait. The Kunari have friends, Templar. How will you answer their allegations? You want to fight? Face someone whose weapons are not bound. Templars are cowards. They only pick on those whose lives they already hold in their hands. Righteous, destroy them. The hell's wrong, righteous? Why did she just run away? What is happening? <laughs> Bastard! Why did you kill the canary for? Back it up. Wrong with you. I'm gonna kill him myself. You're so unnecessary. Why did he do that? Bring this mess to the Viscount's attention. It is a mess. Now we just started with something with the Canaries by killing them. Madness. Madness. Yes, Excellency. What are you gonna do? Chantry involvement. Even if they are fringe elements. Oh, it could not be worse. <sighs> the Chantry has seen the abuses the Templars get away with. Why would they not think to do the same? What are you gonna do? First count. You killed them. All of I them. didn't kill anything. Uh, I suspect a mother of helping. A mother serving the Grand Cleric allowed this to happen. Are you quite sure? Yes. She held a blade with them. Told them to fight you. No, I cannot say I that. I knew she was. Uh... No, of course not. Blasted mother. You have no idea the storm these allegations would cause. It would destroy what support I do have. Maybe I can talk to the canaries. It will not go away. She will lay low for she will lay low for a while, I guess. This may have scared her off. She claimed this was not her intention. Uh, well, that I, is something. I, I don't know. 
I will make my inquiries. Gently. And you should be careful in your associations. For now, we have other problems. <sighs> what problems do we, we have, have now? Delegate, but I can't return the bodies to the Canary in this state. Sarah Hawk. You know the Arishok. What should I do? <sighs> do not hide it. He will know. Why lie? Hiding this would only make it worse. Yeah, it would only make it worse. Just tell the truth. It would, wouldn't it? I'm losing my sense of how to balance this nightmare. I appreciate your help in this matter. As bad as this is, it could have been much worse without you. Uh, I don't Kirk know. Wall owes you. I owe you. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, guys. You guys didn't have to die.